guys, I'm Marina M. Dream with Arkansas M. Dream. Thank you so much for watching. Today I am in Pine Bluff, Arkansas at the Pines Mall in front of one of the most amazing new stores that I have ever seen. Classy and sassy, everybody. Please come on in. We're about to go in, say hello to the owners, the shoppers, and learn all about the latest trends. All right, this is how it looks like. Classy and sassy. They are open for business. Look at the beautiful displays. Aren't you excited to go shopping? Hi, Melinda. Welcome. Yes, look at your store. That is so cute. Did you make it all yourself? Looking so pretty, decorated. Uh, yes, I have painting the yes. Wow. And how long have you been open? Yeah, well, congratulations. I see you have a visitor. Hi. Hi. Hello, yeah, what's your name? Ricky. Yeah, so what are you looking for? I'm just looking at the different variety of things. They have a lot of nice stuff here. Yeah, so which one have you picked out? So you're looking for a I gift like, for... I like this. Oh, look at that. That's awesome. So what do you think about this store? Is this your first time? Yes, ma'am. Okay, so what do you think? I like it. I like it. They got a lot of nice clothing, a lot of nice jewelry. Yeah, so would you recommend this store to other ladies and Definitely. gentlemen who may be looking for a gift? Definitely. Definitely. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for letting us know what you think about it and have fun shopping. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Yes. All right. Well, tell us more. Why Classy and Sassy? Why did you call it this way? Um, well, I was trying to just come up with a really cute name mm -hmm. and all of us ladies have some class and I was like, well, Classy sounded really good. Yeah. So... Then I was like, well, what goes with that? And I was like, well, we all have class and we all have sass. So it just made perfect sense. Yeah, classy and sassy. Classy and sassy. It's amazing. And you actually have a very inspirational story of strength that you came out on the other side and now you're a business owner. Can you please tell us a few words about that? Uh, yes. Uh, last year I was diagnosed with breast cancer. Yeah. And so I had to stop and put this on hold while I focused on that. Finished up with that at the beginning of summer. I'm completely done now. Yeah. Free and clear. Yeah. So I'm a cancer survivor actually now. Wow. And now I'm focusing on the business. Praise the Lord. The new business in Pine Bluff, Arkansas. Well, as we see, it's a women's clothing store. Can you please tell us more? What type of clothes do you have? Any special brands, trends? Okay. Over here, this whole side okay. is... Uh, Plus size only brand. It's called Kiona. They're out of California, American made clothing. Uh -huh. And they go from a zero, which is a 1012, up to a 5X. What? That's and so good. They've got a lot of really cute clothes. Okay. Um, I'm the only retailer in Arkansas for them. Yeah. David's Bridal carries their bridal wear, but I'm it for what you see here. And then over here on the other side, Mm -hmm. This is the Crazy Train brand out of Texas, and they go from an extra small up to a 3X. Wow. So That's good. It's I been selling very well, so I'm kind of low on inventory with that right now. But it's a good problem to have, and I yes. see that you have yes. uh, um, prints, so you say that these are in trends? Yes. The, prints? the prints are very always on trend. Okay. Everything seems to go with them. Yeah. Um, and also, uh, you were talking about the school is coming and UAPB colors you have? Yeah, UAPB is coming up. So these gold pants are really, really, really cute. Yes, they and are cute. Only six dollars. What? They should look um, like for and I've got 50. more of those. I see that you have uh, accessories, you guys, that have beautiful jewelry. That's awesome. And so what if I come to you and I'm not sure what I want. I know nothing about styling. Okay. Can you help with all body types and with all occasions? Yes, I can help with that. If there's whatever occasion you're looking for, I can help you find that. Yeah. So you have tops and buttons and you have um, festive wear and you have athletic wear. It's awesome. I have reading and sunglasses, yeah. uh, handmade jewelry. Yes. Of course, our local fossil find guy. He's actually watching right now, so say hey. <laughs> awesome. And um, you have scarves, purses, everything. So basically, you come here, ladies, and 
you will find something like oh, yeah. for real. Oh yeah. Um, this is you were at my event and you were at Dope Prize. Actually, not at mine. It was Jasmine's event, but I was one of the speakers, and it says, "Dream it, do it, succeed, and give." Awesome. All I right. Also have, mm -hmm. This brand goes from also an extra small up to a three X, mm -hmm. mostly two X, but they could do go to a three X. That's and, so cute. Um, I have this girl's. Uh, goat milk soap. She's mm. local also. I, I'm trying to have some local artists in here that have their their products. Help promote them. <laughs> help promote me. That's Just good. We all do it together. Do you have sales sometimes? Yes, I do. I have I have a uh, summer sale right now where I've got actually most of everything back here is on sale for ten dollars right now. And your prices is so good. I love it. And I see you have shoes. It's awesome. Yeah. And? I have a lot of tank tops to go with all our kimonos. Um, yeah, you have. I have a nice little sitting area back here for, for the guys to sit. And if they need to take a break while the ladies are looking. You have a good day, sir. You too. Thank you. All right, it's awesome. So why do you think it's important to shop local? Shopping local helps all of the local people that live here to be able to support the community as a whole. Yeah. And it helps our families personally out too. You yeah. know, if I didn't do this, I would have a regular job somewhere else. And this is allowing me to have more freedoms to do things with my family and friends that I need to do outside of work. And I've been looking for a business to do and a lot of ladies were complaining about not finding clothes to fit them and that's why I started. Yeah, it's awesome. And I see that you have several dressing rooms that is so important. Sometimes we have to wait in order to try on clothes yeah. and you have several. This, that's very, very good. I love it. Well, this is beautiful, you guys. This is beautiful. And I want to tell you that I have a dress from this store. This is a dress that you might have seen on Facebook. I have it. It fits perfectly. It's so beautiful. I love it. We have socks. And you always try to find new inventory and uh, new yes. styles. And you always come up with new um, ideas to help us dress pretty, right? Yes. Yeah, it's uh, awesome. And um, I love the atmosphere here. It's so friendly and spacious. And uh, you're like in your little world up here, but then when you come yes. out, you can, <laughs> you can come out all nice and pretty. Yes, I've got some different items that no one else has in town too, so. I love it, I love it. So let me turn the, the camera around. I'm gonna ask you one more question. All right, so what would you say to someone who is just opening the business? Don't give up. Okay. Just focus on your goals and do your research. Yeah, I bet you've done a lot of research to know uh, which- Two years of research. Yeah. And going through breast cancer as I was going through that research, so I had to put that on hold to finish that. But two years of research and it's it's been a long road but i'm i'm getting there yeah you are so inspirational and i love your story of strength i call it the story of strength not the story of pain so tell us where you're located and what are your hours of operation i am in the pines mall in pine bluff mm -hmm. we are open monday through saturday from 10 to 8 and on sundays from 12 to 6. yeah how convenient well we want to wish you best of luck and thank, thank you. you so much for opening up a store here you could have opened anywhere in the world you could have opened online but you decided right. to have brick and mortar right here in pine bluff local business up and running so beautiful so caring and you are so knowledgeable as i know that you have been in retail women's closing for industry while. for a long time so it didn't just happen overnight you know melinda didn't right. just wake up and hey i'm gonna be a women's closing store owner you have a lot of experience in helping ladies mm -hmm. and now take that and your passion for beautiful closing and here we are 
it's really incredible you guys i am actually wearing uh one of the necklaces right here that is going home with me as you mm -hmm. see look how beautiful this leaf right here so we want to thank you again for giving us a tour and want to wish you best of luck thank as you, you grow and uh, help and uh, make us look pretty and i do want to thank you for being such an active member of our community yes. you're not just a women uh, women's clothing store you actually give a lot back and you are a member of different organizations and you always come out and support an events and you promote mm -hmm. other business owners you're just such a given person and to think that you have your own story and mm -hmm. now you come out on the other side and just so happy and beautiful and giving and smart and intelligent you guys come on up here and check out classy and sassy yes come see me all right thank you so much say bye 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 guys